Hi girls and guys, it's Mr. Tracky and we're on the right track. So guys, today's video is your top 5 guns in Call of Duty history. So we're going to play a game again. I want you to give me your top 5 guns from your 5th to your, which is your least, to your number 1, which is your favourite since Modern Warfare. Now, if you haven't played that game, you don't have to give a gun from that game. It's that simple, guys. I'm literally going to give you my top five uh, since I've been playing Call of Duty. Now, it can be a secondary. As long as it's a damn gun, I couldn't care less. And this is going to show me in the comment section and so all the subs what the general consensus is because uh, I've never really checked this out myself um, I've always had my particular favourites so I want to know if I rock the boat or whether you agree with me basically so at number 5 and this was a really hard list to put together is going to be the MP5 from Black Ops it was such an awesome little gun and me personally I felt it was really really underrated it was it was awesome with the silencer on it the hip fire on it was brilliant and I've got so many memories with this gun and number four is going to be the UMP 45 of Modern Warfare 2 it's where it all started for me lightweight and marathon commando <laughs> and the UMP silencer yeah cheesy as hell but you know something I cleaned up with that gun cleaned up with that gun at number three is gonna be surprise to some people the famous in black ops now I know this was a fan favorite with most people and it was a gun that dominated black ops <laughs> you'd have a gold for mass and ghost you've probably heard thunder say it a million times if you've been on his channel these ghost bitches with the fallacies <laughs> and that is what made me subscribe to his channel because i found that hilarious because it's the exact thing i used to encounter all the time top prestige famous gold ghost bush wookie suit <laughs> But nevertheless, it was a phenomenal gun and it cannot not be on my list basically. Number two, this may be a shocker to most of you, but for me, this gun just handled so well for me. And initially I didn't like it, but I fell in love with it. And it's one of the guns I've been the most successful with on Call of Duty in general. And that is the AN-94 from Black Ops 2. Such an amazing gun. The first few rounds came out faster than the rest of them. And I uh, really found that so, so helpful. Uh, such an absolute beast of a gun. The damage was so hard. The sights on the gun were great. And it was very reminiscent of the AK-47. For those of you that probably haven't seen the gun very very good memories uh, I know Black Ops did divide Black Ops 2 did divide my clan as such but it did bring us back together in the end uh, many good memories on that game with the AN94 so Mr. Tracky what is your top gun your number one it may not be a surprise to you guys but my best gun in Call of Duty history is the ACR from Modern Warfare 2 such a versatile easy to use gun the accuracy was insane bit of a hit marker machine at times but for me it just handled so perfectly and it was so satisfying to kill people with this gun and uh, I adore that gun to this day although it's robbed me of three nuclears on the last kill because of its hit markers there were some guns that didn't make the list guys that you're probably surprised uh, the likes of the Razorback which I got my first nuclear with 
MP7 in Black Ops 2 and Modern Warfare 3. With that we'd focus on and rapid fire was absolute beast. The AK-74U. The G11 was another gun from Black Ops which I adored and the reload animation was just so brilliant. The iron sight was spot on. The models from Modern Warfare, Akimbo, oh my god. <laughs> OP. That, 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 they are the holy grail of OP in my personal opinion. The AA-12 was a beast of a shotgun. I remember first using that. I fucking loved them. Really loved them. And the Galil from Black Ops holds a special place in my heart as well. But it didn't quite make the list for me. Guys, that is pretty much it from me today. I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, please don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Don't forget to comment down below with your favourite five. And as always guys, don't forget to stay on the right track. Peace.